Hey guys, Dave back with you today. Uh, today is December 20th, 2020. Uh, we're winding down to Christmas here. We got another beautiful day here. It's pretty cold. It's in the mid 40s right now. So I'm going to be dressing a little bit warmer than normal. Um, but I'm taking this chance to get out for a little paddle here. I uh, went up high in my garage, got the ladder out, and I brought the uh, original Thunderbolt X1 out today with me. This will be my boat of choice. Um, I'm going to be testing out my new paddle pogies. I did a review of these a couple weeks ago. Um, I'm actually going to use them today for the first time. Um, I've got my winter hat that my lovely daughter knitted for me uh, last Christmas with my uh, color scheme here. So that's pretty cool. So I'm getting my gear ready and I just wanted to say thank you. Um, you've been uh, very supportive this year. When I started doing these videos and created this blog, um, my whole point was just to share my passion for paddling with others, network with other paddlers, and maybe if in some way um, try to give back or uh, donate to worthy charities or whatnot, support river races, conservation efforts, whatever that may be. Uh, many of you know that I sell plans for a kayak ergometer um, made out of a converted old Nordic uh, ski machine, Nordic track ski machine. I sell plans for that, and the idea there was, uh, I, I shared that video, yeah, I don't know, seven, eight, nine years ago on the one I built for myself, and people reached out and said, hey, will you make the plans available? I'd like to build one. It took me years to do that, but I finally did it. So I sell those plans on how to build your own ergometer. Um, my only objective at that point was to share it with others and um, maybe uh, cover some of my expenses here and, and hopefully get the break even with web hosting and equipment and whatnot. Well, this year has been a pretty good year. Um, I've done, I've doubled down on product reviews and I've been making some uh, Amazon affiliates commissions, which I use that money to just buy more products to do more reviews to bring to you. Um, you'll find that on my YouTube playlist. Um, and I did a little bit better than break even this year. So I'm, I'm happy to announce that, uh, well, I'll, I'll announce that within the next couple days, um, I'll announce a donation I'm making to a local worthy charity that I just recently found out about. Uh, so I've covered my costs for web hosting and, and whatnot. So uh, I want to I give back to a local charity. And I've got an interview coming in the next couple days here to, to tell you all about that. But I just want to say thank you. Happy holidays. Um, get out there, paddle, stay healthy. And uh, whatever you do, share your passion and your love of paddle sports with others. Um, and, you know, let's just support each other. Uh, some of the discussions online take kind of an ugly turn um, on some controversial issues related to paddling. Believe it or not, there are such things. Just be respectful and just know everybody's coming from a different perspective. I know when people approach me and say, oh, you're a kayaker, you know, do you do so-and-so? And it made me realize there are so many different types of just kayaking they're almost different sports. I mean, people who rig their kayaks with fishing gear and go down a river and float and fish, they're kayakers. K1 sprint Olympic kayakers, they're kayakers. I mean, arguably you might call it canoeing. Um, then you have inland people like me who were weekend warriors. We like to do races. We're kayakers. You have recreational people and, you know, kind of wide, stable, short boats that just like to go out and paddle for the joy of it. They're kayakers. So, you know, there's no such thing as one uh, type of kayaking and I think we lose track of that sometimes when we get onto these uh, into these online discussions um, we assume everybody's doing the same thing we are and that's simply not the case so um, be respectful tr try to find ways to resolve controversy not add to it and again happy holidays um, I'll touch base after I'm done paddling today but I hope you're doing well I hope you're being safe I hope you're being healthy and uh, I'll talk to you shortly. Hey guys, so I'm back off the water after that workout. Did a, just about 11 miles today. I went a little bit farther than I thought. Um, I encountered a couple bald eagles up there that, that were absolutely beautiful to see. And a big flock of somewhat angry geese. Now, they were not aggressive, thankfully. Um, however, you know, some of the best uh, kayaking videos on YouTube are when people are getting attacked by geese. So that would have been cool. But uh, that didn't happen. Oh boy, I beat a rower. I just wanted to follow up on these paddle pogies. Um, after about a mile and a half, I realized I didn't like the way the Velcro 
uh, seam was rubbing against my thumbs, so I just flipped them over so the, the Velcro was on top of my knuckles, and um, that did a really good job, and my hands stayed nice and warm and cozy the whole time. So these solved a long-term problem for me. I had never been able to find a pair of gloves that were both comfortable and warm. My hands stayed really snug in these, so uh, I would highly recommend them. You see a rower behind me here. Um, I avoided all of them today and they avoided me, so that's a good thing, I guess. Um, we, we get along, we like each other, but it's always better if you don't uh, encounter each other in traffic and the flow of things. So, alright guys, talk to you soon. Take care.